Hi. First of all, let me wish everyone around the world who is celebrating Easter today a very happy Easter. And today I want to discuss how to prepare a model rocket for flight for beginners in rocketry. When you first start out in rocketry, there are several things that you need to do to prepare your rocket before launch. One is you need recovery wadding. This is flame proof and it will protect your rocket from your rocket's parachute from melting during ejection charge. Take the recovery wadding. Now for this size, it's about an inch and a half diameter. You will need about eight, seven or eight sheets. So take the recovery wadding one by one, crumple it up, press it into the body tube of the rocket. And most of the rockets that you buy will have instructions telling you um, how many sheets of recovery wadding you will need. I think I may have two together here, which is okay, but I'd rather have them separated. I can't get it apart. I'll just put them in there. All right. Now, what I prefer to do, and you can do it your own way, is take the shock cord and very carefully tuck it down into the body tube. Different people have different ways of doing things, but this is how I do it. Now, another thing that you want to do is you want to fully unfold your parachute before you refold it and put it into the, lawn, uh, the uh, body tube. This will make sure that it doesn't stick, that it's fully capable of opening, and that the lines are not tangled. Fold it back the way it was, fold it over in half the other way, and place it down into the body tube. Some people wrap the cord around the chute. I don't really like to do that. So, and then tuck the shock cord and the parachute cord down into the body tube. And place the nose cone. All right. Then take your engine. 
This is a V6-4 Estes model rocket engine. Take your rocket engine igniter and what I do is I place the igniter all the way in then I put the plug into the hole and press down to hold it in place I bend it over and I separate the two wires so that I can make sure the clips do not touch when I attach the igniter clips. Now this rocket that I have here, it's an ESAM 58, has an engine retainer compartment. So I just slide the engine in to the retainer that way it's good to go you attach the igniter clips do the countdown, and you're ready for launch. Very simple, very easy. And with the B with the B engine that this this rocket has, this rocket is about a 3.1 ounce rocket, <clears throat> and it is capable of reaching on a B engine. At least 400 feet so that is how you prepare a model rocket for flight enjoy your hobby thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe happy Easter and I'll see you next time